Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all well. Um, if you're new here, then don't forget to click that subscribe button, turn on post notifications, give this video a thumbs up, and also thanks for clicking on this video. It means a lot to me. So for today's video, I thought I would do a life update video. Um, so basically just updating you guys on um, what's been happening in my life. Um, so... If you enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up. Subscribe down below for more videos. Um, I upload three times a week. And I upload beauty, fashion and lifestyle videos. As well as many other videos. So if there's any videos you would like to see or are your favourites at the moment. Please let me know in the comments below. It would really help me out. Um, so without further ado, let's get into the video. So first off, I thought I would just talk about generally how my sixth form studies are going. Um, so at the moment, they're going okay. Um, so if you haven't watched the video where I explained what subjects I was doing, then um, I'm basically doing the International Baccalaureate, um, which is um, a very good grounding for uni. It's also a very tough course. Um, I do six subjects, I do English, Spanish and History all at high level and then I do um, Nature of Science, Maths and Anthropology at standard level. Um, I really like the variety of subjects that it can offer to you um, and it can offer you many pathways after you leave sixth form which is also a very good thing. Um, however the course has been tough and um, since I've been back, um, I haven't really done anything because I've been doing my mock exams, which I'll come on to later in the video. Um, but before um, Christmas holidays, it was mainly just coursework and IAs and revision and um, completing or making sure we meet the deadline for university application, personal statement. Um, so it was very much hectic and I was very busy and it's safe to say I was probably stressed, um, which I am most of the time. Um, so yeah, sixth form is going okay and um, I will be glad when we finish in May because we obviously have our exams then and then after that we have the prom and then... I have like nearly three and a half months off before I go to universities but I get my results really early on. I get them in July which is really early. Um, so yeah I'm looking forward to finishing but also it's going to be very stressful for me. Um, so I may not always upload or I may not always have time because I have to prioritise my work. I know that this is also, I love doing this but I have to prioritise my work because that is what takes priority and I want to get grades to get into universities and if I don't then um, it won't be very good because I'll have to uh, find another route to go down and I, I've always wanted to go to university um, so yeah uh, that's it about my six form studies. Um, moving on to university so before the Christmas holidays, long before that, we um, had to go to open days at like different universities. Um, and once we'd been to them, there was a certain date that we had to apply to them via UCAS. Um, so the deadline has just been and gone yesterday, um, but our school deadline was different. So... Um, our school deadline was before the Christmas holidays, so we basically had to um, do our personal statement and um, put in the course that we wanted to do at different universities. Um, we could do either um, two firm options or five choices. So I decided to do uh, five choices because it gives me a wider range of universities to choose from and also all of them have different entry requirements um, so yeah exciting times um, and before Christmas 
half term I also got four offers through on UCAS um, basically all of the four universities out of the five had offered me places there but they were conditional offers which means they're only based on um, you have to get a certain grade to get into that university so yeah I have applied to Bishop Grotesque which is in Lincoln University of Lincoln, De Montfort, um, University of Derby and Nottingham Trent um, but my preferences would have to be Lincoln um, only based on like the course and just the general feel that I got um, so over the next coming few months I'll be attending applicant days which is basically where you go and find out more about the course and go and talk to students and get a feel for what the um, lesson or like the session would actually be like um, so if I don't upload then it's probably because I'm at an applicant day um, I've got one next Saturday um, which is University of Derby so there will still be a video um, well obviously it will be on the Sunday but I just won't have time on the Friday to film as that's why I'm filming ahead of schedule um, so yeah so it's starting times because that is going to come around really quickly and I'm really looking forward to it as much as it may sound stupid that I'm looking forward to university I actually am like having my own independence and going on to further my passion for history um, yeah and then my January mock exams which I've only just finished I finished them today um, so I'm really happy with how they went although the college were a bit disorganised um, they didn't manage to have the right papers and the formula booklets um, there was a day when they didn't have enough formula booklets to give out so I had to start my exam and then they gave me a formula booklet like 10 minutes into my exam which I was pretty annoyed about because um, I had to do the questions that didn't have any um, any formula like required um, but most of them did require a formula so it was a bit annoying but other than that I feel like they went really well but they're only a practice and so we can see like where we're at and where we need to improve for our May um, 2019 exams um, which are going to come around really quickly and that's why I need to um, start like revising now because if I revise in advance and I revise a long time before um, I feel like it's more proven to um, help me and c I can commit like all the information to long term memory um, so like some of the well the exams are literally on everything that we've done since the beginning of year 12 um, so yeah it was pretty it was there was quite a lot to like remember but it was um, it was a good practice to see um, how the real things would work in May this year um, so yeah I think that's everything um, also tomorrow I am uh, I was going to do a day in the life vlog but um, unfortunately um, last minute they the history teacher wants us to go in for one lesson which I feel is a bit pointless because it's, um, it's my day off tomorrow and we are not expected to go in um, so I was going to do a day in the life vlog um, but obviously I'm not going to now because I have to go into sick form and I don't really want to vlog there um, so I'm also having my hair cut tomorrow so um, make sure you're active on my socials because I'll be posting a picture of what my hair looked like before and after um, and if you want to see a video of hair transformation then let me know in the comments below um, other than that, I think that's everything. Um, so if you guys did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up. Subscribe down below. Turn on the post notifications because I upload daily as I set up. I upload three times a week. I upload beauty, fashion and lifestyle. So if that's the sort of videos that you 
enjoy watching then stick around you don't want to miss any uploads um so until next time um i will see you guys in my next video bye guys